32 years ago, I was diagnosed with a form of muscular dystrophy. For some, those memories formed in a backyard as a young kid can stick with you a lifetime. That's certainly true for Joe Warren. And I had a friend uh, named Jason Bryant who would, when we would play football and I'd get tackled, I couldn't stand up on my own. He would reach down, bear hug me, and stand me up. He was a good friend that allowed me to have some, a little bit of normalcy while I was dealing with my own disease. Fast forward three decades, both ending up in a profession geared around helping others. Joe Warren, a firefighter in Macomb Township. Jason Bryant in Detroit. Growing up through childhood and what he went through, um, it's always stayed with me, you know. Um, just the fight he went through and just never giving up. The two haven't seen each other since childhood and didn't even know they were both firefighters until now. A little overwhelming, to be honest with you. Bryant standing by Joe's side as he continues to raise money to help firefighters and their families affected by cancer by walking 140 miles in full gear from Macomb Township to Grand Rapids. It's actually heartbreaking to hear that he had cancer because of everything he had done for me. It was only a few months ago that Joe learned of his childhood friend's cancer fight. Clear cell renal cell carcinoma started in my left kidney and unfortunately before, before we were able to get to it, metastasized my spine. When I found that out, I was able to say, hey, I can get him more money now that I know he's a firefighter, which is good. It's bad he's got cancer, but now I can really help him out. A portion of the proceeds raised this year will go towards Jason's recovery effort. Just to know that there's as much support out there as there is um, means everything. So 30 years later, it's an honor and a privilege to be able to give back to you what you gave me, even if it's something small. Thank you for being here. He's, he's picking me up now. Kind of a full circle thing, I guess. You know, it's, uh, it just means everything to me. In Macomb Township, Nick Perot.